So are these basically just gonna be sorry saps that sit around doing nothing? You kidding me? I'll build a fucking watchtower and prison your asses. Throw you in the damn generator. Use your blood and bones to fuel it. Hello everybody, I'm Echo, and welcome back to Frostpunk. Now, last episode, we... I guess you could say restarted our journey. Um, a few episodes ago, or the first three episodes of the series, the city we built was very dysfunctional. It was my first time playing, and basically, it was screwed from day one. This time, though, I in one episode, I got further than I did in three. <laughs> um, and... I'm much better off. I'm I have a few problems here or there, but I'm quickly I I have expeditions going, I have a dedicated team to doing that. I have wood, steel, and coal production. We are nowhere near risking running out of coal. I have plenty of wood, plenty of steel, I'm constantly working on research, I have plenty of food coming in, and in general, it would take quite the cataclysmic event for this to break down for this city to fall it would have to take a really bad event i mean i have so many engineers right now i have some work in a goddamn bar <laughs> like that's what some of the engineers are doing the smartest people in the city work in a bar not saying uh, you know smart people can't work a bar just you know smartest people in the city and they're working on a bar and i have two workshops going i think these will Make it so it will take less time. I don't think I can have... I don't think I can have, um... I don't know. No, no, I want to look. Yeah. I can have 130 research rates. For, uh... Because I have two of them. So I can add more. So the more of these the I have, the faster I can research. I think I'm gonna build another one real quick. I have the resources, so... You know, the faster I can produce more things... Like, why not? I had the researches. I'm pretty sure the team's currently out investigating some other stuff. So, might as well. Uh, research. I unlocked this level. I th can't remember what exactly I was going for in the second level. Oh, oh, I'm stupid. Okay, I thought you had to upgrade le tier one for each different thing. I didn't realize it was just an in general thing. Okay, I feel so stupid for doing that. I mean, it's not stupid. I just didn't realize that's how it worked. Okay, that's much better. Ooh, we can upgrade power the amount of power the generator's given off. I, ooh, or range. Oh. Oh, hold on. Give me one second. Sorry about that. <laughs> Freaking. I have a hedgehog. She's blind, but she's still the sweetest thing ever, and she she loves that goddamn wheel so much. I, I needed to, like, tip it over so she wasn't able to run run it well. It wasn't so loud, I wouldn't mind, but it is just so goddamn loud. So, coal mining. So, the thing, the things that we have, they, they basically produce what you could get from having workers work on a, um, coal thingy. And a, a, a coal thingy, coal thingy. Uh, coal deposit. Basically, it creates coal deposits for you to work from. But coal mining is similar to steel or woodwork, where you don't need someone to collect it. You just need it working. Mmm. And it requires a power cell, which I only have one of. I don't know how to get more of them. I don't think they're actually called power cells. I think that's from Fallout. That's where I'm getting that from. Okay, so this will provide wood. It's a wall drill, which actually, that's not a bad way to get wood. And that won't really take up much space at all. Um, I want to work on upgrading the generator and stuff and, like, 
working on factory stuff and I can imagine that's gonna require extra power and it, the cold is becoming a bit of a problem so let's get working on coal mining because once I can research more coal stuff then you know it'll cascade into other stuff I go rebuild one and go build another um workshop because I have another um uh, what are they called? Why am I blanking? Uh, engineer. I have another engineer that I can place. I have a perfect spot for it right there. It's only one engineer, but the group is still out re uh, reconning areas, so hopefully that'll help. I think I'm just gonna, in general, kind of start, um... Oh, I'm out of wood at that point. I think I'm just in general going to start running streets in between all the buildings to just kind of keep things running, work uh, work on things a bit more. Like, just try and interconnect the city a bit more. I'm not really sure. And there, I, I do want to mention, there are technically other scenarios. Um, I don't think I'll be able to build anything else because I'm out of wood. But there are other scenarios that you can do I don't know what the difference is between them um, I thought this was kind of the main thing maybe it is maybe it isn't I don't really know um, right now we are working on facing starvation which I think thanks to the amount of hunters we have working um, I'm pretty sure we should have no problem getting that done uh, I'm just trying to think of things I can do I don't think I really can do much right now I mean, research is gonna start and then I can toss once the buildings are built I'll be able to toss some engineers in so you know uh what happened oh really I was that close to this happening I I you you may not understand what I'm talking about. In the first three episodes, this happened at the very end, and this was basically the end of me. This is where you have to make a decision on which way you want to go. Then, I was like, I don't really care which way I go because I'm screwed no matter what. But, you understand, this was kind of where my playthrough ended that time. But this time... Okay, so this happens... On this day I never or maybe it I don't know why it happens but you know we'll figure it out he found an exhausted man at the edge of our city he said that he came from winter home a settlement located not far from here and that he was the last survivor winter home is dead everyone's dead there's no hope for survival in this accursed wasteland you're all doomed you must escape those were his last words well, it seems like this guy's coming here just to stir shit up, because he escaped, yet he's dead. There's not much out there. Like, this city isn't breaking down yet. Like, it's very much in control. It's very much under everything. Like, it's not have it's not struggling. At this point, what we're struggling to do is find ways to continue expanding and improving. Oh, we had a person die. The news has shocked everyone in the city. There were supposed to be many settlements and construction crews here. People living normal lives in homes heated by generators, but we're alone. I mean, you are li living normal lives in homes heated. And Things aren't that bad here. You realize that, right? I'm gonna work on better lodging for you guys as well. Hope falls. Great. So this guy did come here. Screw with me. What? You wanna hang me for what this guy said? We should never have left Britain. Uh, why did Winterhome fail? Are we going to die here too? This place is a deadly trap. We need to get out. What the fuck? What happened? Okay, so I think 
this will be a testament to whether or not you truly prepared your city. Because if you have, then that massive drop in hope won't be a problem. You'll be able to pull things back together. Ah, you gotta be kidding me, you sorry cunt. What the fuck? People were happy, and then you come here bringing all this depressing shit? Come on. I thought 2020 was about to end, not continue. They're all dead? How will we survive here without any help? We have to go back to London. There's no hope for us here in this frozen desert. People start to gather as news of the fate of Winterholm spreads through the city. Some of them want to drop everything and flee to London. Panic is starting to set in. I must give them purpose. So this is where you choose the path. I mean... Ah... The city's pretty goddamn stable as it is. There's not... Hmm... Order. Uh, neighborhood watch. Um, you... We need to mobilize and stand together to help people in need and protect them from troublemakers. Watchtowers increase hope of people living nearby. So yeah, this is something we need. Just in general to help. Just push people in the right direction. Because, you know. Oh, come on. The unconvinced want to leave. Sir, you're... You've convinced the majority, but hope is low. A group of our people are still scared that they want to flee the city for London in 15 days. You gotta try and change their minds. You say order will save us nonsense. What are we going to orderly decide who eats first when we start to starve? We're not really starving. Uh, kind of a little bit, but we'll give it like two days and we'll have stockpiles of food. Uh, if we don't try to reach London, we'll end up like Winterholm. You, you, you saw the guy that showed up here, right? He was pretty shit out of luck. He died on our doorstep, and you want to go out there? You literally have a warm generator. What is wrong with you people? Oh, God. Fucking idiots. So, what do they want from me then? I know what the Londoners are. What do they want from me again? So, a handful of people will be causing... Oh, I can't really read it. Uh, some unrest. Don't let the Londoners disrupt the city. How can I stop them? So, are these basically just going to be sorry saps that sit around doing nothing? You kidding me? Build a fucking watchtower and prison your asses. Throw you in the damn generator. Use your blood and bones to fuel it. We're not going to actually do that. That's a joke. Yeah, we're not even kind of hard up for food. Everyone's gonna be eating soon. God damn, why that guy had to show up. Right now, we have 25 ill. We have 22 healing. Oh, research done. Holy crap, that was quick. Okay. Uh, new research. Where do we want to go from here? I'm thinking build... I think I want to go down... Actually, I'm going to go down this to increase how quickly medical posts work. And then I'm going to go for bunk houses to improve the general housing. That should hopefully work to a certain degree. Prove things. Come on. And get through a few days. Uh, cold home. Heat them all? I don't, I don't know, really know what you're complaining about. Uh, I guess a lot of them are looking kind of chilly. Um, let's put overdrive on for a little. See how that helps. Oh, God, I got so many tabs. Uh, order, watch showers. I can do that in a minute. Uh, yeah, 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 we got... I have one there already. I want to place one here. That will fill in basically most of the area. I can work generators in and other areas to kind of work on the heat there as well. But there we go. What does a um coal plant require? Coal mine. 
And thing is, once I get the coal mines running, if I get enough of them going, I may be able to remove these coal mines and then have even more people to focus on other... Well, it probably require people, but I could probably... I'll get more coal for less people, you know. I would need a gathering hut and a coal production place. I would only need one or the other. Ooh, uh, I didn't throw the generator off of that. No, 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 no. We, we have plenty. Mm, and it's not built yet. So we'll wait for it to be built. Should check on the generator. It's fine for right now. Oh, someone's injured during a duel. Good for you. Stress is fine. Oh, we're just barely out of range. Um, place you guys in there. Get one engineer going in here to produce some coal. Hopefully, balance it out a little bit. I can actually take a few people out of here. Just kind of keep these working. Hopefully that will rebalance it out. Oh, never mind. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Do not do that. One thing I'm a little worried about is the um, batteries. I'm worried about those. Oh, I don't know what just happened. Something happened. Okay, I gotta maintain that heat level. Ooh, how's the generator doing? Fine. Nowhere near exploding yet. Oh, what just happened? Oh, scouts. Scared the crap out of me. All oh, right, I sent you guys out here. Wow, you've been gone for a while. Ooh, wood, ration, steam cores. That's good. That's really good. Um... The shelter is comfortable and will equip and well equipped with emergency supplies. There's a notice posted by the heavy round door. Tall scientists, if you use any supplies, remember to notify the quartermaster upon your return to the city. This means there's another city out there. Sign posted by trail two directions. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Now you take the resources and you know what? I'm thinking, you guys walk your happy asses there. I'll sort out the city, and hopefully when you find that city, it will help me deal with the traitors down here. People join the Londoners. So the people who want to leave for London have successfully urged their friends and neighbors to join them. People are easily persuaded because they have little hope in our ultimate survival. Oh, you guys really, really shouldn't piss me off. You know that? Because I am going to get the hope back. And then I'm going to burn you to death. Seriously, you're pissing me off here. Hungry fed. Okay. Gonna maintain. Oh. Medical posts are working faster now. Nice. Meant to pause. Okay. Um... One research. Let's go for... Oh, I don't have the stuff to research it. Ooh, steel's a problem. Steel's a new problem. Yeah, I don't got any steel. Gotta wait a little bit. Uh, We don't have any other people. Oh! Toss a few more into there. Not sure why there wasn't those people in there. Um... I can't think of what else I can do. Ooh, generator! Generator, generator! I may not be able to maintain the heat. I need to turn it off. I need to let it de stress a little bit. Damn it! Damn it! I should have left it on. I should have left it on, but I did. Ah! Come on! You kidding me? Do you want the generator to explode? I'm trying my best here! Getting screwed. I'm really getting screwed here. Do people not like the bar? <laughs> I'm trying my best. Dude, giving it everything I got. Apparently that ain't good enough for you bastards. Hopefully whenever they get to that city, they'll find something to help. Only medical works. Uh, I may have just screwed myself with that. Let's try building watchtowers real quick. See if that helps. Need more steel for sure. 
Um, there's a dense bit of housing. This isn't too. Uh, place it here. It'll leave me a bit more room to work with for building around it. And I sh should be able to build. There we go. That interconnects everything, I think. Wait a little bit and I'll get some more wood. Oh! Uh... Oh, son of a... People are desperate. Sir, we need... I'm working on the guard tower. Ah. Hold. Just hold. Oh, my God. I screwed up the warmth, and now I think I'm completely screwed. That shows how easy it is to just get completely boned. I made one little mistake and suddenly everyone wants to just cut my head off and display it on a goddamn post. Okay, scouts are there, so if we... Uh, what? We stopped at the edge of a deep, wide ravine, marveling at the steel bridge spanning it, even more so at the huge aton- what? Autonomon sweeping snow from the roadway. It would be possible to send the machine back to our city f or dismantle it for resources. Mm. Bring it back. I want an Autonomon. Uh, we reprogrammed it to send it that way. This is desperate. Uh, disappear in the distance, walking slowly towards the city. First whiffs of snow started to settle on the bridge. Nice. Ooh. We got a new location. So, winter weather station. Arch convoy. Oh, go check out the convoy. That's good. So, the Tanamon will be here soon. The Tanamon? Am I saying that right? I don't think I am. Ooh, it has cargo. So, what can it do for me? Can it deal with the traitors? That would be funny. It comes in here and it's just like, You want to destroy my city? Take this and just smites them by stepping on their dumbasses. Freaking idiots. You have a warm generator and you're complaining. God damn, it's like a moody teenager. And I should know I am a moody teenager. Oh, uh, what now? I'm trying here. Uh, search for our city's frame bridge and we'll provide. What? Race question where is the bridge? That uh, deserted. Why wasn't it known under care of an engineer? <sighs> I don't need hope to go down, you bastards. I need to go back up. Great, 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 great. So we're, we're continuing to get kicked in the dick right now. Just need a little more steel. Every time, I'm, I'm so close to getting more steel, and then I just don't. I can't even get anything. No mm, lot. Good. Hopefully I can get a law that will tell me I can just smite these fools. Ooh, uh... Adaptation. I don't think I need anything from here. I don't think anything new would be in here. That would really help. No, all of this would hurt, hope. I don't need that right now, so let's go to purpose, see what we can do. Morning gatherers. Gathering. Uh, we will gather each morning to make sure our goals and priorities for the day are clear to everyone. Morning gatherers will slightly raise hope from time to time, but we'll raise slightly. Guard stations. An, organiza an organized... An organized... Uh... Militant will maintain peace and order in our city and help us deal with anyone who might threaten it. Ooh. I don't really have to spare resources right now and do that. Morning gatherings can happen on their own. And I can just use my next law to do something else, and that helps. That does help. Coal is still hurting, though. We're good on food and everything else. It's just coal and the sick right now. 
that we're struggling with a little bit. Do I have that coal mill up and running yet? Did I place it down? Did I ever place the damn thing down? I don't think I actually have one. Not yet, at least. What do they cost? I know a steam generator, 25 wood, and... 10 steel. What a kick in the dick. Just need one more steel. It should hope. Ah, come on, people. You're making this more difficult. Let's go see what the scouts have to say, and I'll deal with that later. Uh, they sought winter home. The workers who were riding in the convoy, convoy told us there were, they were heading for the city of Winterholm. We were supposed to follow the signal from the beacon, but we couldn't pick it up, they say. We tried to follow a certain path pattern to find it but we ran out of fuel okay uh bring them back we need the people just in case these dickheads actually leave though i th i'm not sure will that help any i'm not exactly sure i'm gonna need to wait a minute to see if I get any changes, but I wonder if that's gonna help with my problems down here. They're gonna get back, and their leader's head's gonna be on a pike, and the generator's gonna be cool, and they're gonna be like, What the hell happened? We brought more people, and what just happened? And they're gonna be like, well, these guys, they, they were so convincing, they told us we should leave, you know? We should leave the warmth of the generator that keeps us alive. And we thought it was such a good idea to leave the city that has very few problems. And is in a, a very much working condition. Might say a few little things here or there, because we're pricks about time. Like, that's the entire thing. I... They're leaving a warm city because of a few minor issues. You see the flaw in the logic there, right? How that's pretty stupid thing. That's a pretty stupid thing to do. Okay. The thing is, while I do have these morons to deal with, I also know I need to handle this. I need to get um, coal up and running because if we run out of coal and the generator goes cold, I'm pretty screwed. <laughs> like, there's no doubt about it. I will get Judas. Uh, oh. Uh, 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 new thing. Word of advice Steam cores. We just use our first Steam cores. Steam cores are a necessary component in advanced technology. Uh, we can't manufacture steam cores in the sea, so let's hope that our scouts find them during the expeditions. Okay, so I can't make them. I can only find them, but I don't think they're required. Right? I don't think they're required to do it. I think one steam core will keep it running. Honestly, I think I could care less if the Londoners leave. Like, hope I can raise... If the Londoners... I have plenty of time to deal with the Londoners. Hope it's like, I can deal with that. It's not too difficult. Honestly, I could care less if they leave. They seem like pretty traitorous bastards, so I don't know why I would give two shits if they're gone. Just get a new law going. Purpose. I'm thinking. Ooh, foreman. Um. Appointed responsible foreman will make sure that people work as efficiently as possible, increase eventually. By 40% for 24 hours. New ability, foreman. Um. Mm, I think that would be a good place to start. I don't exactly want to go down the route of imprisoning people and stuff. I think that's a little bit dangerous. But I do want to, you know, kind of show that I don't really want to imprison these people as dumb as they are. Because to a certain degree, they do... They do have certain points, and I do admit that. So, you know, I'm not going to try and imprison them. Whoa, what happened? Oh. Oh. Wasn't that just great? <laughs> uh, according to law, whatever. Damn. Oh, got workers in there. Actually, get the watchtower. I mean, do I need everyone in a watchtower? Where's the watchtower? There's the watchtower. There we go. Wow. I'm so screwed. Oh, convoy's back. 
Whoa, people, food, steam cores, wood, everything. Holy crap. Well, if I was in need of stuff before, I'm definitely not now. 19 engineers, that is good. That is good, 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 good. Um, let's see here. I think I need to upgrade the generator range. I need to be able to work at a bigger range. Um, sawmill can be working faster. Uh, we can man this one to be working. Um, oh. Hey, this thing's here. Okay, that's actually really freaking cool. What is it gonna do? How is it gonna get down here, actually? <laughs> Probably the same way everything else does. Uh, Tonamon, where to go? What can I do with it? Oh, uh, Tonations. Oh. So, they're just... Cruz. <laughs> Well, that's most of our goal situation dealt with, right? Yeah, wow. Wow, that is so good. Okay. Um. That's cool dealt with. Guess get more wood going. Don't really have much other places that they can go. Oh. What happened? What, what's going on? Uh, what? What the hell is going on over here? Order of advice. Using automons. Our first automaton is operational. This will help our economy greatly. Automons replace entire manual labor crews. They work on a short breaks to refuel a generator. We research them. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. That is perfectly fine. Apparently, I can make them, but I managed to find one, which is lucky. I guess. I don't know. Is it lucky? Okay, I can up the range. Do it. Up. Um. Oh. Oh. I'm confused. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sorry. Oh, it reaches out here now. Yeah, I need to turn overdrive off, otherwise, I'm gonna blow this damn thing up. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. Just trying to keep my mind in check so I know what I'm doing. Then I'm gonna be screwed on the hope thing. Ooh. Well, that's one thing. Ooh. Ooh. Your time has come. Well, that's the second time I screwed a city. I did so well, though. I thought I did well. Doomed anyway. So. What could I have possibly done better there? I guess not... Mm. If I didn't screw up the heating, I think I would have been fine. I think I would have survived, but nope. I managed to screw it up. But for right now, I hope you all enjoy. This has been a whole lot of fun. I enjoyed this. It's fun. I may have lost the second city again, but it was worth it. I learned a lot. Um... I realize a lot of different things, and I can see a few different places where I can improve on my strategy with this to build a very efficient city. But for now, hope you all enjoyed. If you did, think about leaving a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I've been Echo Gaming. Hope you are. Hope you be well. Be good. I'll see all of you in the next one. Goodbye.